Hi there, everyone. Hi, everyone. Welcome to Bright River Chapel on Sunday, the 28th of January, 2024. And we're speaking to you uh, from Northumberland. And uh, I hope that wherever you are today, we can worship and mm. pray and share together uh, how good the Lord is and, and mm. his work in our lives. The Lord is good and he does good, it says in one of the Psalms. So um, let's pray before mm. we start. Yeah, Father God, we thank you that you are here with us, that you are Lord of our lives, that you are the all-powerful God that created the heavens and the earth. We just thank you that you are our Father and that you love us as your children. So we welcome you today, Father God, and we say we want to come and give you all the glory, all the praise as we worship you and just thank you for loving us, for being in our lives, for mm. giving, for, for sending Jesus to give his life mm. for us. We praise you, Jesus. Yeah. yeah, come and be amongst us. Lead us today, Holy Spirit, in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. So I'll just check that everything is going okay on the Facebook Live. What kind of week have we been having, darling? Um, well, it's been a good week. <laughs> yes, it's been a good week. We've had some some lovely times. Um, well, we've just had a lovely time of friendship and fellowship and at someone else's house, just uh, sharing and praising God and eating together, which has been lovely. And we had a lovely time on Friday as well, mm. having a come away, come aside time in the afternoon at... Uh, yeah, good friends. The good friends. Robin and, Robin and Carol. Carol. Charlton, yes. Yeah, in their prayer garden, which has a, a brook running through it. And it's a very large, uh, expansive place. But we spent some time inside just just being still, being quiet. You may discover time. that near you are places like this. If you go yeah. to a website to do with Quiet Garden Trust, if you mm. Google that, you'll get a website that has the locations of um, mm. places like that where you can just go and be quiet and uh, yes. um, cool. all over the UK, all over yeah. the world, actually. So you might be interested yeah. in looking up um, a prayer garden near you. So, yeah. But, uh, you know, we can create our own prayer garden in the middle yeah. of the storm of life, even. Yeah. Um, apparently, Charles Wesley's <clears> mum, <throat> in the middle of all the turmoil of raising kids, we just put the apron over her head and go into a, a quiet place for a moment in the middle of all the busyness of um, looking after a family. So it is always possible, yeah. wherever you are, to find a, a prayer garden. So we're going to start with mm. I See the King of Glory. Yeah, I See the King of Glory. I see the King of Glory Coming down the clouds with fire The whole earth shakes The whole earth shakes I see His love and mercy Washing over all our sin The people sing The people Sing. Hosanna, Hosanna, Hosanna in the highest, Hosanna, Hosanna. A generation rising up to take their place with selfless faith, with selfless faith. I see a near revival stirring as we pray and seek 
We're on our knees, we're on our knees. Hosanna, Hosanna, Hosanna in the highest. Hosanna. heart and make it clean. Open up my eyes to the things unseen. Show me how to love like you have loved me. Break my heart for what breaks yours. Everything I am for your kingdom's cause. As I walk from earth into eternity Hosanna 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 in the highest Hosanna Heal my heart and make it clean Open up my eyes to the things unseen Show me how to love like you And love me Break my heart for what breaks yours Everything I am for your kingdom's as I walk from earth into eternity As I walk from earth into eternity You know we're not always aware of the, the Lord's loving hand on us and how even in our <coughs> childhood he was with us you know he guided our steps we didn't always know it he was there excuse me he was there doing um that Thank wonderful you. caring lovely work yes and uh, um i read a a poem by a, somebody at the back end of the 17th century you know it's quite recent then uh -huh um the other day a guy called joseph addison and uh he was really a poem all about the different phases of our life uh, where we perhaps we didn't even realize that god had been looking after us and then later on um when we rush into our teenage years in his words these words are like this it says when in the slippery paths of youth with heedless steps I ran, your arm unseen conveyed me safe and led me up to man. So there's that time of life mm. where we, we're almost rushing into folly, folly you know, that, that slippery path of youth where we don't even really take notice of our steps and the ground we're running on. Mm. And yet God's arm, his unseen arm was there conveying us through to safety and into mm. our adult life. Um, mm. So I love that sense of God's mm. faithfulness in that. Mm. Praise the Lord. Yeah. Do you want to share anything with Well, I was just looking at the next song, which is Jesus Take Me As I Am. And I was just marvelling at how God uh, sees us through all those phases from, um, <clears throat> you know, being... The, the sort of little children tr just trusting in their mum and dad and uh, sometimes getting lost. I remember getting lost as a little child and uh, thinking um, in the middle of a Woolworths, it was a huge shop 
with loads of uh, toys. It was uh, near Christmas, I think. And I stopped, was looking at all these toys and then thought, oh, where's my mummy? <laughs> and in the distance, I saw a blue coat. I thought, there she is, you know, because she was wearing a blue coat. So I, I ran, pushed through these people to this blue coat and grabbed hold of it. And then the woman turned around and it wasn't my mummy. It was someone else and uh, burst into tears. And needless to say, someone, um, some shop assistant came and helped me to find my mum who was, who was looking for me somewhere else. <laughs> yeah, so, uh, but I was just thinking how Jesus loves us, takes us as we are in all our mess and all our, you know, silliness and all the stages of our lives, really. And his hand is upon us. And certainly I felt his hand upon me. Um, or in As I grew up, I knew that his hand had been upon me during all those phases. Mm -hmm. And he's he's calling us to himself and saying, just come to me. You know, I'm the one that loves you just as you are, just as you are. I love you. Well, yeah. Jesus, take me as I am. Jesus, take me as I am. I can come no other way. Take me deeper into you Make my flesh life melt away Make me like a precious star Crystal clear and finely hard Life of Jesus shining through Giving glory back to you Jesus take me as I am I can come no other way Take me deeper into you Make my flesh life melt away Make me like a precious star Crystal clear and finely hard Life of Jesus shining through Giving glory back to you Jesus take me as I am I can come no other way Take me deeper into you Make my flesh life melt away Make me like a precious star Crystal clear and finely whole Life of Jesus shining through Giving glory back to you Life of Jesus shining through Giving glory back to you glory Lord yes I give you glory yeah we just thank you for how you've been shaping us like those precious stones that need shaping 
for the light to shine through. That your and it's your glory, your work in us that is seen and visible, shines through, shines through and draws others to Jesus. So help us, Lord, to be like those shining stars. As it says in Philippians 2, that we are like shining stars as we hold out God's word. Mm. Your, your light is shining because you've made your home inside us. Yes, yeah. Lord. Praise the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Mm. Give you glory. Um, we're in January, yeah. aren't we? We are. And, uh, yes, still just. It's a lot of sleeps till <coughs> Christmas, I believe. Um, <laughs> In the words of Kermit the Frog in Muppet's <laughs> Christmas Carol, how many sleeps to Christmas? Mm -hmm. um, but the, uh, something I did feel God was warning mm. me about, and it might be something for you to pick up on uh, as well, um, is really how um, mm. we can sometimes uh, try and make shortcuts, really, in what God is doing and, uh, and not be prepared to walk in that faith and patience that are needed to see the good harvest come through. And uh, it says that we're not to, to do that, really, um, not to grow weary in well-doing, not to get worn down, um, but to just keep our eyes fixed on Jesus, let him um, bring us through. Mm. And he promises us, promises us mm. in Galatians 6, 9, 10, that in due course we will reap a harvest mm. um, if we do not give up. And um, so let's persist in the good fight of faith, in faith and patience, and not try to, to jump ship, as it were, and either jump ship entirely and say, oh, blow this, and go off and uh, look for some uh, uh, something that's not at all what the Lord wants in our lives, or um, get fooled into thinking uh, that maybe this is it, Lord. I don't need to go through all these um, hard character transforming hoops in my life, but I'll just leap on uh, to uh, what looks like a, a quick fix solution. So if that applies to you, take that as a, a thought at the beginning of the year um, to, um, to keep steady in the Lord and let him open doors as we need them opening, close doors as they need to be closed, not mm. to uh, rush for some quick solution that we think is going to give us all the the answers really let mm. me just pray something about that yeah Lord, if we're mm. Thank you, if Jesus. we are in that frame of mind where we're getting impatient lord mm. i pray that we might settle back right. in your faith and in your patience and let you unfold those good and necessary steps mm. to a harvest mm. and we not grow weary but keep our confidence and our good hope in you, the God who is good and who does good. Thank you, Lord, mm -hmm. for your goodness, your mercy that you're follows good. us good. all the days of our lives. Amen. Amen. Yeah. In fact, I was um, uh, when I was getting distracted, I was trying to be quiet before the Lord, and your mind starts to wander, and a lovely lady called Hillary. Garray some time ago, I'm sure it's not original to her, but she was mm. the one that taught us this thought that it's good to just um, have a sort of settling sentence to bring your heart and your mind back in mm. God's frame. And so as I was quiet, immediately I felt that the, the sentence to just help me to keep anchored in and centred on God was the word, Jesus, my shepherd. So that's a, a good word, isn't it? Jesus, my shepherd. Straight out of Psalm 23. And yeah. of course, that ends with goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives. So let the Lord be your centre. Uh, keep your eyes fixed on him and he will unfold a good harvest. He is our shepherd. <clears throat> and in him we lack no good thing, it says in Psalm 23. Yeah. Praise, Praise the Lord. The Lord. Good. Mm. Let's sing. Lord, I lift your name on high, and uh, we won't be, uh, uh, that this will be our final song today, so uh, if there's any other thoughts uh, that you might have, or um, if, you're, if you're out there listening and you want to encourage us, um, 
message us. It's, uh, we're always up for a message. We'll give you the email in a few minutes time to be able to contact mm. us. And, <coughs> and there may be something as well that my darling, beautiful mm. wife here wants to share as well. I don't know. Yes. No pressure. Lord, <laughs> Lord I lift your name on high. Yes, let's think. Lord, I lift your name on high Lord, I love to sing your praises I'm so glad you're in my life I'm so glad you came to save us It came from heaven to earth to show the way from the earth to the cross, my debt to pay. From the cross to the grave, from the grave to the sky. Lord, I lift your name on high. Lord, I lift your name on high. Lord, I love to sing your praises. Glad you're in my life. I'm so glad you came to save us. You came from heaven to earth to show the way from the earth to the cross. My dead to pay from the cross to the grave, from the grave to the sky. Lord, I lift your name on high. You came from heaven to earth to show the way from the earth to the cross. My debt to pay from the cross to the grave, from the grave to the sky. Lord, I lift your name on high. Lord, I lift your name name on high. Lord, I thank you for this time that we've had together today. Encourage and strengthen each one of us, Lord, as we uh, worship you, our sovereign, wonderful God. Be glorified in us. As we go about our week this week, we ask that we will shine out with your glory, that we will learn how to love. We will, our hearts will beat with your heart and we will learn how to love those around us. Well, if you um, want to get in contact with us and share something, mm -hmm. you're very welcome. Uh, 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 the email is Bob Bain, B O B B A I N, at hotmail.co.uk. Mm. Um, we generally put the Zoom link up on the Facebook uh, newsfeed. So if you uh, want to get the details there, you're welcome. Uh, on Bob Bain, of Bob course. Bob Bain, Facebook. Facebook yeah. Right. But um, yeah. uh, otherwise, if you just email us and we'll we'll be in contact. If you want to go on the Zoom, you're very welcome. We and uh, uh, we generally stay and pray uh, after the live recording yeah. for a little while as well. Yeah, with um, those on the Zoom. On those on the Zoom, yes. So uh, if you want the, want to do that, you you need to come on at mm -hmm. four. But we we usually start the Facebook live and the live recording at four fifteen. So yeah. Have a really good week. If you're already in your week and you're watching this on the YouTube channel, Welcome Network's YouTube channel, then yeah. um, have a good rest of the week. Yes. <laughs> and uh, you can yeah. join us next Sunday, which is the 4th of February on Bright River Chapel yeah. again. So I just wanted to speak out that blessing from the Bible, um, from Numbers. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face to shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord turn his face towards you and give you peace. Amen.
Amen. So peace. Shalom. Rest, wow. rest in his peace mm. this week. Even if it's busy. <laughs> um, yeah. Praise the Lord. And happy yeah. birthday to you, Roger. I hope yeah. you um, can connect with us on uh, sometime soon. And a big mm. shout out to you, Rob Armstrong. And uh, uh, big hugs to you, Paula. Paula. Uh, God nice bless to you. see you watching. Yeah. So, um, yeah, have a good week. Yeah, We're sending you love through the airwaves. <laughs> Yeah, God bless. Bye, Bye for then. now. See, See you, you for next now. time. Bye-bye.